hello guys welcome back to my channel welcome to fish academy uh in today's video i want to discuss with you um aquaponic system though actually i i said something about aquaponic in one of my video but the the video quality was very very bad and there uh, was uh, not uh, the audio was also very very bad so i i'm so sorry for those of you that have seen that video uh, so i have to bring another video so that you can see and uh, hear me clearly that is the essence of this video and as i said earlier i want to talk about the aquaponic system aquaponic system aquaponic system uh, is this one of the video my viewers which may include you have been uh, expecting on this channel and today i have to bring it uh, uh, right on board so you can uh, get details about aquaponic and how you can set it up in your farm uh, um, and before i forget if this is your first time of checking on this channel you are welcome to fish academy uh, all you need to do is for you to look below this video click on the subscribe button and after that also click on the notification button this is order for you to be notified whenever we bring you new video and if you are not new to this channel it means that you are already a subscriber and I want to thank you for making this channel your most preferred channel on YouTube. Um, for those of you that have been sharing it, all you need to do is uh, keep sharing this video with your friends. It's like those ones you know that they are into fish farming or those ones that, um, that intend to go into fish farming. Things like these are, are things they need to know. And uh, also, let's not forget about the training that is coming up in Port Harcourt, Nigeria. Uh, the training practical masterclass coming up on the 12th and on the 13th of april next month april 2019 is going to be pure practical class pure practical masterclass on how to do so many things it's not just all about these ones you've been watching on this channel it's going to be practical you are going to use your hand to, to touch to do and to see how it's being done so you just need to be there on the 12th and on the 13th of april if you don't have if you don't have interest in at, uh, at going into fish farming you can actually you send someone either your brother your sister your relative uh, anybody or people that are you know you if you train they will become useful to themselves you can actually send them to attend this training because it's not just for you this the training might be to help uh, a brother or to help a sister you can uh, uh, empower your, your people your community uh, by sending them to attend this training in Port Harcourt. Uh, it's not something much, very, very cheap. Uh, you are going to gain full knowledge on how everything about fish farming. I mean, pure, practical on fish farming. However, let's go back to what we are to discuss today. Uh, what I sense, if, if, you are, if you attend the training, I, I think some of you will, will, may go back with uh, this plant that is floating on this water. Uh, I think I will give some people, I will give it to some people, it multiplies a lot. Uh, but let's talk about the plant. This is water I sent. I'm, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not, not to talk about the plant anyway. I want to talk about aquaponic. What is aquaponic? You know, aquaponic, to, to put it in a simple way, simple form for you to understand, aquaponic is a system in, a, in, a, in, a, in aquaculture is actually um, uh, a good relationship between a, a plant and between the plant and fish aquaponic system there are various types of aquaponic they are the automated aquaponic system which uh, in other words you will need to uh, recycling the, the recycling is done uh, in an automated way and uh, also there is you can also do the manual type it's all aquaponic once uh, the fish benefit from the plant plant and the plant also benefit from the fish is simple uh, simple uh, that is the, the simple logic as regards aquaponic system in aquaculture uh, so in this case like as you see inside this water the fish uh, uh, the fish pr uh, produce or the metabol metabolic waste after they have eaten enough food just like human being you know the uh, stew and all those stuff so after the fish they have eaten they push out what they have eaten as waste into the water and the, uh, the water become polluted uh, that is if there is nothing inside it uh, and if you don't change your water on time the water will just become polluted but if you have something like this like a plant inside the water once the fish produces waste 
uh, they excrete the waste uh, from their body, the plant will now make use of the waste from the fish. So because they are making use, uh, use of the waste from the fish, the plant uh, uh, grows better inside the water and it also it helps to purify, to, to uh, uh, normalize the water back for the fish by making the water to be a little bit crystal, the nitrate, removing the nitrate and every other thing inside the water to make the water good for the fish. In other words, you, you, if you have something like this, if you have been, if you have been changing your water uh, 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 twice in a week, you end up seeing that you change your water once every week or you change your water two times in a week depending on the quantity of the plant or the, the, uh, the recycling you, you, you usually take place. Um, at, there are times, uh, that is for the floating uh, aquaponic system like the floating plants you are seeing here. At times, for the automated type uh, where you recycle your water, you send your water to where you have your plant, where you have your nursery, and then the plants and the soil there then filter uh, filter the entire water, making use of a uh, filter. You know, once it's filtered the water, the waste from the fish will now re re remain on the surface of the soil where your plants are. So the plants will now make use of the, the waste from the fish to grow better, then the soil will now filter the water and then you now take the water back to your pond. That is also an aquaculture, uh, uh, that is aquaponic, aquaponic system. So it can either be this way or this way. Now the question is, what plant can I use to, for aquaponic system? The one inside here is water I sent. Let me get one out for you to see very, very well how it, it will look like. Well, just pray that I don't fall inside the water because it won't be funny at all. Oh, man. Yeah, man. Oh, God. This is beautiful. Is this not nice? This is something great. This is something very, very nice. This is water I sent. Can you see? And in some places, he's causing havoc. We are aware, we've been listening to news, we've been watching it on various channels, that water I sent is actually taking over the entire water uh, in some part of the world. But uh, to us, as fish farmers, we are also looking for it in order for us to use it to crystallize, to make our water crystal for fish and to also, uh, yes. So this is water I sent, and this is a flower. Wow. You can see so this plant does not sink at all it doesn't sink and with seeing the plant you know why it does not sink because right here we have some floaters here that will never allow the plant to go into the water like foam it's like foam like floater like your cork that is how this this uh, the stem and all this above uh, that is how they are so it, in, it helps the plants to keep floating on top of the water and this is the root can you see this is the root so the roots no matter where the waste uh, materials are this uh, root is somehow sticky in nature it attracts waste where, where if, if a waste if maybe once fish uh, this, uh, uh, push out their waste uh, product and the, this plant will just like attract the waste to this to this to the root here you can see it attracts it and make use of it and once it makes use of it it helps to clear the water so the the waste that's supposed to be moving or to be moving around the water the the odor the everything that makes your water not nice for the fish the odor the everything this plant will help to take care of that that is the function of this plant it might not be just water i sent you may have other plants like the water lettuce and every other thing that you can use to achieve this and in some country uh, they I'm aware that some country they, they eat uh, some places they do eat uh, this water plant in other words if you are from those country where water ice and is being eaten where they eat water ice and you can actually grow your water ice in this way and and you have your fish inside they will just be growing very very well also this water ice science you are seeing here you can also use it to produce your animal feed either for your fish for your birds for anything all you need to do is for it to cut off this uh, this part and then you dry it 
after you've dried, you blend it, you add it to your animal feed. Uh, either you are prison fish feed or anything, it's also very, very good for your fish. Why this? Once you've removed this other part uh, at the root, you can also use this as a fertilizer uh, as to fertilize your soil uh, in the farm. It, it is also very, very good. So this is the essence. That is a water essence. And with me here in the farm, I have my cousin. Andy, please come, 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 come. The, the world want to see you. Uh, this is Andy. Yes, Andy, Andy. Uh, or is known as Anibia, but prefer to be called Andy. Andy, you are welcome to my farm. You, you are welcome you. to Fish Thank Academy's you. farm. Uh, Andy, Andy has been watching my videos. Actually, this is my, is, is my cousin. And uh, I think he's, he's, he's coming to my farm for the second time. The first time he came to this farm, uh, there, there was, I was, it was just with some white four plastics. For those of you that have been following me on this channel, the first time he came here, the farm was not as large as what it is today. And, and after then, he returned. And on coming back, what do you have to say as regards the farm? With rest, uh, regards to the what you uh, okay, let me put it this way. After he came, he saw the place and he's highly impressed that the, the farm is taking shape drastically, it's taking shape rapidly. Uh, that is, and, and he said that he wants, and uh, actually, he wants to come and learn to know how this is done so that he can also set it up in his place. And he wants to become a potential billionaire. Uh, within a very short time and uh, that is why he has come uh, in order for uh, to learn how to go about aquaponic system you can actually uh, take the same step that Andy is taking do you have a brother do you have a sister you want him to to become something in life you want him to, to hold this hold this hold this this is what I said you want him to, to, to become something in life, you can actually send him. The training that I'm organizing in Port Harcourt is for everybody. But whether you are a fish farmer, you're not a fish farmer, you're a poultry farmer, you are, you are anybody can achieve attend this training. All you need to pay is a token. Should I disclose the amount? Let me disclose it so that you, some people might think that uh, it's very, very expensive. It's not expensive at all. With just 20,000 Naira, you will know how to breed your fish, how to ash your fish, how to formulate your fish feed, how to construct your pond, how to, this aquaponic system, we are going to see it live, how it can be done, how to construct a mobile vat, how, uh, being your ashery, maybe you want to be moving your, maybe you have a land, or you have a place, but that land is not actually yours, and you want to set up, you want to construct some mobile vat so that when you get your, your place you can move it out maybe it's an rented a place you don't want to construct a concrete you will learn how to construct this mobile vat for ashing for grow out and for every other thing and you will learn how to treat your fish you will learn about fingerlings management you will learn about fries management you will learn about a pond management as a whole and uh, so many things we have is a power pack a practical master class put together by uh, the, by Fish Academy and other experts uh, that are planning to come to that event. And also on that day, there are going to be things that are going to be on sales. If you want quality fingerlings, juveniles are also going to be on sale. Um, fish feed, I mean fish meal are also going to be on sale at a very cheap rate. You may be to, to produce your own fish feed. Because I usually advise uh, people, whenever you, if you want to succeed in fish farming, then you will really need to know how to pro produce your own fish. Not just knowing how to produce your own fish feed, you need to produce your fish feed in order for you to maximize profit in your farm. So these things are going to be available, not just the formula, the machine also that you can use to produce your fish feed is going to be sample. So if you want to buy, you come with your money and then you get the machine, then you return it to wherever you, you want to uh, do your farm, or you want to uh, get the machine on that day, you make your payment down, then on that day you just come and pick your machine up. All you need to do, for more information, just contact my, your, my number is on the screen, you click uh, your uh, call, it's also a WhatsApp line, uh, you can also call or you WhatsApp, um, 
uh, we chat or also drop your message on email and also to register for the training you also click on the link just check on the description button click on it and uh, you will see the link click on it to register you don't register more than once click on it to register from anywhere i have people coming in from tanzania i have people coming in from uh, uh, places across the country across nigeria in order to attend this training and also to help train others so you don't need to miss this training this training if you miss it is not like other training is this is this particular type of training is a type of training that I maybe have not been organized before let me tell you a story when i went before i started my own fish farm before i started this farm um i went for a training and you know what happened on that training day what all we did there the man uh, bought uh, some fingerlings he bought fingerlings he doesn't ash he bought fingerlings and on that training day all we we're doing was to sort his fish to sort fish that is what we we're doing sorting so we are sorting we're helping him to sort thousands of fish he bought like fourteen thousand fingerlings that day so we helped to remove the smaller ones to a particular place the bigger one to a particular place and at the end of the day we counted the fish into uh into uh, his pond uh counting that is all the people that went for the training we counted the fish into his pond and uh, he showed us uh, this juvenile this fingerlings and that and that was the end of the training but this particular one is not just like that it's not just like that you just need to be there we are go we are having so many people we are having we are also bringing in a bank in order for them to discuss how you can get a Greek loan loan to start your business so this is an abit and I, I tell you very soon, Anibet Andy is going to be a potential billionaire through fish farming. In Nigeria, we have over 2 million, over 200 million people in Nigeria. And how can they survive without food? That's why fish farming is very, very important in Nigeria. I have so many people that have come into Nigeria to invest in agriculture, in aquaculture, and I think it's the right step in the right direction. And this is the trending thing in Nigeria fish farming. Till I come your way some other time, I remain your humble friend, Francis of Fish Academy. And with me, Andy. Goodbye. Bye. Join us. Join us on that day. You. Subscribe to the channel, Bye. Fish Academy. Expect to see you with top order, with potential fish farmers. Fish farmers that have been in the business for a very long time are going to be recognized. You are going to see different people. I'm hoping to bring you a lot of fish farmers that you've been hearing, you've been listening, you've been hearing their names, and across the world, you are going to see them there on that day. Thank you very much for checking out my channel. Click on the subscribe button below this video to subscribe and to also click on the notification button uh, to like come your way. Ah.